can we think back and remember like who the most moving teachers were in our lives as when we were children? We never remember what they say, but we remember how they were, how they were in relationship to uh, the subject matter, whether they had passion for what they were teaching, whether they had passion for you in relationship to what they were teaching, whether they could see you as you were, rather than just one more student sitting in the class. That's actually very rare to have as a student, to have an experience of uh, learning in that kind of a way. But imagine if the teachers showed up fully embodied and knowing why they were there and loving it, loving what they were doing, okay? That's a shorthand for saying that their doing is coming out of their being. Okay. So when we learn to cultivate the domain of being, it's not so that we can become permanent navel gazers and never do anything and be good for nothing, you know, uh, but quite the contrary, because the doing informs the being in an intimate way that allows each to nurture the other and then the doing coming from a much deeper place is much more creative, much more incisive, much more uh, easy going often, or when it's the going is very difficult, uh, you stay with it because your motivation is coming out of being, which is, I guess, another way of also saying it's coming out of love.